Hey guys, and welcome to my channel today, and I hope you have fun watching this video because I am going to have fun making it, and yeah, I'll make sure to link my Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook, and Twitter down below. Um, okay, to start off, I'm going to use this um, Yes to Natural Man Charcoal Detoxing Paper Mask. Uh, yeah, it's I, a face mask for men. I mean, they gender everything. It says, yes to being a, being the masked man with superhero skin. Formulated with charcoal and witch hazel to deep clean and help prevent ingrown hairs and razor burn. So, I just uh, shaved today. And this is the first time I've been clean shaven in a while because usually I just trim it up. I'm going to be applying this mask and letting that sit on my skin for like 10 minutes. And then, you know, do the rest. And then I'll start my makeup. Okay, uh, hey guys. Um, yeah, I just applied the mask. It smells amazing. And it feels really good. It's like really cooling on my face. So now I just have to wait 10 minutes. And then I can take it off. And then I guess I'll start my makeup routine. Let's hope this feels, like, this feels really good. So let's hope it does a lot of, like, good. <laughs> Although, like, I wish, like... I mean, when you shave, you usually shave, like, under your chin and your neck, too. So, I mean, this mask, like, if they really want to help with, like, ingrown hairs and, like, they're, like, using a razor on your face, they should, they should really, like, bring it down your neck. But, yeah, that's the only thing I have to say about that. But, yeah, I'll see you guys again in, like, um, ten minutes. I'm just gonna go relax and then take this off and prepare my face. And then I'll come and we'll do some makeup. So, hey guys, my timer went off, and now it's time to take off the mask. Are you ready for me to peel back the mask so you can see my face and we can see the transformation? Mm -hmm. Am I hideous yet? Don't answer that, because I, I will cut you. But yeah, so, um, let's get started, and we're gonna do my makeup, and it's gonna look cute as fuck. I hope so <laughs> I'm doing the no mirror makeup challenge uh, and also going to try to do a rainbow look with it yeah so um, I hope you guys have fun with me today and I'm gonna try to have fun so to get started I'm gonna go in with my uh, hard candy uh, sheer envy pore defense primer serum and I'm gonna mix that with a little bit of my uh, tone adjusting uh, primer from elf so yeah so we're just gonna take this primer and smack it all over my face. Okay, so to start off, I'm gonna use the CoverGirl uh, CoverGirl Clean Matte uh, Foundation in the shade Ivory, and then also the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation in the shade Buff Bisque. And I'm gonna mix them together on the back of my hand so I can get like a more better color, I guess. I don't know. I hope it works. I'm so bad at finding my color. See, so yeah, I got a little bit of that on the back of my hand. And I'm doing all this without a mirror. So, just wish me luck, guys. Just just wish me luck. And I'm also going to add uh, this e.l.f. Um, liquid highlighter. I'm going to add some of that to my foundation to give me like a nice, glowy, shiny, beautiful look. Just going to add a little bit of that in there, too. Just mixing that all together. So, yeah. Now I'm just going to pat that all over my face. And just, you know, go to town with it. You can't forget your ears, people. And down into your neck. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm going to be talking a lot while I'm doing this today. Just so I can, like, talk to you guys and let you guys know a little bit more about me. Okay, so again, I'm going to add a little bit more of these uh, liquid highlighter. Just so I can make myself glow. So that way my rainbow look will be more, like, just... Bam. I'm just gonna pop that on my cheekbone, then over here into my brow bone. Okay, so now we're gonna go in with my uh, CoverGirl Clean Concealer in the shade Light Pale. I'm just gonna pop that under my eyes. And then I'm gonna put a little bit on my forehead, you know, and down on my nose, just kind of brighten it up. I'm gonna take this little point and just kind of pop it and blend it in. So I want to take a little bit of this setting powder. I'm going to put it under my eye and just kind of set my whole face. Now we're going to contour my face a little bit while the setting powder is on there. Um, because this is a no mirror makeup challenge, I will be covering up my mirror. And I'm going to use my e.l.f. stipple brush to mix these two shades right here on top, the two darker shades, as my contour. Tap a little bit off. 
And then um, when you suck in your cheek to do your contour, people like to put it in there, but really that's not the best place for it because like, it'll just kind of make you look sunken in and like sick and like kind of like dead, like a skull, you know, like a skeleton. So really you're supposed to put it like just above that just to kind of like sculpt your face and not make you look sickly. Yeah. And when you contour, you want to do a three on your face like so. Yeah, just like that. <laughs> So now I'm going to pop this uh, next to lightest shade right here on my nose and like cheekbones a little bit, kind of highlight them. So now I'm just blending in my contour and like my setting powder. Just to help my face look more smashed. Now I'm going to go into my eyes. I'm going to use my BH Cosmetics eyeshadow palette. Uh, I'm trying to do a rainbow look, but I don't really have that many colors. But I wish I had some yellows, but I sadly, I don't. I don't feel like using an eyeshadow primer right now because I'm really lazy. So I'm just going to go in with this uh, red shade right here. And I'm just going to pop it in my outer corner. And do it on both sides. Next, I'm going to go in with this pink shade. I'm going to do it to both sides as well and just kind of work my way in. Next, I'm going to go in with this purple shade. And then I'm going to go in with this green. Next, I'm going to go in with this darker purple and just kind of apply that here and bring it out over my crease. And then for my inner corner, I'm gonna go with this light blue shade here and just rub my brush around in that and pop it in the inner corner of my eye and bring that out. So now I'm gonna do my under eye with just the red, the green, and the blue. I'm gonna go in with my mascara and hope and pray I don't stab myself in the eye and don't mess up too bad. So now do the brows. You wanna do light strokes, you know, the lighter the stroke, the better. And you wanna kinda of go naturally with your hair, the way your hair grows. So let's say a little prayer and just hope I don't mess up. Okay, next step. Oh, why is my eye wiring? Oh, I, ho I hope I look not too crazy. So the next step, I'm gonna take a little bit of this, um, these eyeshadows and attempt to do a colorful rainbow blush, I guess. I'm gonna go with my Wet n Wild Color Icon blush and just kind of pop some of that. My, the next step I'm going to do and my most favorite step is highlighting. I'm gonna go in with my um, Jeffree Star Skin Frost in the shade Eclipse uh, and I'm just gonna take it and use my stipple brush from e.l.f. and just pop that at the peaks of my cheekbones. And also just, you know, around the eyebrow bone and then just on the brow bone itself. And just give me some color and life and just reflectiveness. I want to be a street sign, a traffic sign. Okay, we're done with the... Jeffree Star. So now I'm going to use a little bit of my Wet n Wild um, Mega Glow Highlighting Powder. Oh, 
We're going on to the lips. So I'm going to be using my Jeffree Star Velour Liquid Lipstick in the shade I'm Shook. Just to outline my lips. So wish me luck. I messed up. <laughs> anyway, so now we're gonna go in my NYX uh, Liquid Suede in the shade Kitten Heels. We're just gonna kind of apply that here. Just to kind of brighten up the center of my lips. And lastly, I'm gonna go in with my Jordana, Jordana Twist and Shine Moisturizing Lip Balm. I'm just gonna pop that in the very, very center. Just so yeah. Anyway, now I'm just gonna blend this all together, like. And um, just to kind of help set the uh, lip balm to make it more matte, I'm gonna take my uh, shading brush and I'm gonna dip it into some of my uh, Elf translucent powder. And just kind of pat it on. So yeah, now I'm just going with that step for a second and I'm going to brush it off. <clears throat> okay. Lastly, to finish it all, I'm just going to take this brush and just dust off any extra powders and stuff off my face. Okay. I'm just gonna go in and curl my. No, I don't know. I'm gonna curl my lashes a little bit. Okay. Oh. So yeah. Um. This is my no mirror rainbow makeup look, and I'm about to see what I look like. So. Let's wish me luck, you guys. Okay, then. Um, it's not terrible. Okay, I see my brow. Oh, what even, guys? What is this? My brow is not... Oh, my gosh. You guys see this? Do you guys look at that? What even, people? What even? Oh, I didn't even look at my lips. I just got shocked and sh I, like, I was shook by my eyes. Okay, the overdraw is a little extreme. It kind of looks like I've been drinking Kool-Aid. But it doesn't look terrible. I'm so shiny all over. Okay, so that's the last time I used illuminating drops, I guess, inside of my foundation. But, ooh, I'm so shiny. Oh, my God. <laughs> but, yeah, um... I hope you guys had fun. I had fun. And uh, yeah, so just stay tuned for more videos and just more laughter. And hopefully I can come up with some more funny stuff. And like, if you guys want to give me some ideas of what to do or what you would like to see, just, you know, hit me up on Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, or Facebook, or anything, you know? Um, yeah, and yeah, I'll just hope you guys had fun, because I had fun.